I had a customer ask me how to make the butterflies look 3D, kind of with their wings bent a little bit. Wafer paper is a starch sheet. It's made of potato starch, and it's like a communion wafer kind of in, in the texture. So it does, it's not like a real paper, and it absorbs moisture. So if you want to make it kind of bend the wings a little bit, you can put it in your hand like this and just gently hold it until the heat from your hands kind of makes it curl up. And you can kind of feel it moving but it'll soften up. You can also hold it over steam. I would not advise that for small things because it will melt them and it'll it'll make them curl really fast. But you can get it soft and then kind of bend the, the wings a little bit. You can leave it propped up next to something and let it dry. And when it dries, it'll hold that shape. But when I put them on cakes and cupcakes, I just put them directly on the cake or cupcake and I don't do this. I just, I just put it on flat. What usually happens is that the underside, which is what's facing the icing, that will absorb some of the moisture from the icing and it will naturally curl up away from it. So if you put them on flat, it's still gonna kind of move around with the moisture in the air. And even if you curl them like this and you have them in a certain position, once you put it on the cake, it's gonna move around. So just be aware of that, but it's not hard to do this. And if you want to do the backside um, with another printed butterfly, you can take another butterfly like this and attach it. I do have a video showing how to do that and I will link it up at the top so look up at the top and it's very easy to do these but if you just put them on the cupcakes or the cake it will kind of naturally curve up like this so that it looks like it's it's more there's more motion to it and that's it so if you have any questions please feel free to leave a comment underneath and i will talk to you guys later